Have you ever had a dream that you wanted to paint so you went ahead and made a couple of videos about it? So I have a basic sketch over here and what I can remember from my dream was a basic courtyard, a house at the back over there, cars over here, and a huge tree, and not really much in the background over there. But now the perspective is a little off, so I'm just gonna try and fix a couple of things that are needed over here. All of this because my main point is to just get a basic sketch across. Definitely was a bunion. Change the camera angle a bit to give a better idea of what kind of perspective I'm working with. And I don't know why, but my hand feels just feels drawn. Definitely one that I remember. So obviously if those are my perspective lines, that's where the car is going. Average size, that's actually a very big tree considering the entire perspective is what I'm working with. Looks okay as far as I remember, but if I really get into it, I feel like this was a car over here, this was the house that I remember, and the, the shadows over there, and there was a, a huge wall that like had to turn the corner. Obviously this is from my height, from my perspective. Um, I'm just gonna erase this again. That about seems right. Pile of bricks. Tree. Sky. Wilderness bunion tree, basically. Street lamp for my light. Probably have a light here or somewhere over here. Everything is going to be illuminated in orange. And just a very simple dirt ground. And that is my sketch for the painting. I will fix a couple of things like this line here, boundary wall, things like that, but I will I have enough information that I need personally to just start painting now. So, very easily, I just, I have my palette over here from a previous painting, from another painting that I was doing on the side. I'm just gonna do a quick 
wash, like a basic color study of what I need, what I wanted. I would not recommend doing this because the paints are a bit dry. pretty muddy but it's still a basic basic overview of what I want um, I have my shadows, I have my main goal now is to just see as how far I can push these values now this is uh, the palette that I've been using um, there's ultramarine blue there's primary red there was primary yellow over here I had a bit of pastel yellow and titanium white and some ivory black all of it is pretty much used up because all of this was dry-ish from the start and this is my basic like this is my basic view of what I actually do now it's starting to take shape and take form this is what I actually remember from my dream obviously there are going to be some a couple of highlights of the tree over here it's very muddy it's very murky but it's what works for me and I like working on a reduced scale where I have a lot of white on the corner so I can practice a couple of different tones that I'd like and I'm gonna leave this here tackle it another day see what comes out of it so yeah thank you for watching <laughs>